told you how sweet he is to us. He just loves us unconditionally. You know, the same love we have for our kids, you know, it's, it's magnified a thousand times that. We can't even imagine the love he has for us. For him to send his son to die, that we just, you know, we can be saved by sheer grace. Nothing else. I mean, we yeah. can't do anything yes. but believe that God sent his son. We, no matter how great we've been or we feel we've been, all the things that we've done in our lives, that's not going to get us into heaven. It's his grace. Yes. Nothing more than his grace. And, and I thank him for that. Thank you. And, and thank you. He's a great God. Yes, he is. And I just want to say thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. In my heart. Oh, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, thank you, Jesus. In my heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. In my heart.
And, it, and, and as we sing the song, thank you, thank you, Jesus, it's, you know, it leads into our time of testimony, you know. And I have a great testimony, you know. You know, we listened about Brother Daryl, and I, I debated whether I was going to say anything about it, but, you know, God is great, you know. And, and my son called me last, the other day, last Thursday, was it? Last Thursday, and told me he had got shot, you know. And, you know, you don't think about things like that. He said he was at a stop sign, somebody ran up behind him, and some little thugs jumped in his vehicle and tried to rob him, and he told me, all I got is three dollars, I just put the rest of my money in, in the car with gas. You know, you can have these three dollars, this gun don't scare me, you know. And he said the thugs just started laughing and they got out, but when they got out, they started shooting in the car. And, and all he got was his little pinky shot, and, you know. And, a testimony to how great God is. You know, I could be, you know, planning a funeral for my son, but God has kept him. You know, and I think that's because God loves me, and He doesn't want to see anything happening right now. And it, another thing, He said, the passenger next to him, the bullet went right by their head. You know, that they they did the projectory, and it came. And it, you know, a few inches more, it would have killed that person. So, you know, this is all because of God. God didn't choose that time for them, you know. So, you know, let's not decide for ourselves when God chooses a time for us, or we choose a time. God will, God will work His own miracles. And so we just got to trust in Him 100%, you know. And sometimes I have problems with that, and I deviate. But I step back and say, devil, you can't do this to me. It's about God. Yeah. As long as I believe in God, you can say what you want to, but, I, you know, that's just work. So, so I'm just happy to be here just to thank God for all he's done for me. So, you know, I done read my mouth. So anybody else would like to have a testimony? Mm -hmm.